Hi and welcome to the Matrix Algebra for Dummies. In this lesson you will learn about matrix addition and subtraction and matrix multiplication by a scalar that is a number. All these operations are quite simple so you will learn them very easily. Now if you want to get regular updates about new lessons please subscribe to my channel. Matrix addition and subtraction are very simple operations, but before you can learn how to perform these operations, you must remember two important rules. The first rule is that the result of the matrix addition and subtraction is always another matrix, and the second rule is to add or to subtract two matrices, they must have same size and shape, that is they must have same order. Well, what does this mean? For example, let's say we have these two matrices, first with elements 1, 2, 3, and second with elements for example 4, 5, 6. These two matrices cannot be added nor subtracted because they don't have same size and shape. First matrix has three rows and one column, that is its order is 3 by 1, while the second matrix has one row and three columns, that is its order is 1 by 3. But on the other hand, these two matrices, first with elements 1, 2, 3, 4, and second with elements 11, 13, 15, and 17, can be added and subtracted because they have same size and shape. Both of them have order 2 by 2. The same is for these two matrices. First with elements 13, 17, 27, and second with elements 44, 66, 88. Now this, both of these matrices have same size and shape and their order is 3 by 1. That is they can be added and subtracted. Let's say there are two matrices you want to add and for simplicity let's take that both of them have order 2 by 2. Now let the first matrix A consist of the elements a11, A12, A21 and A22 and matrix B consists of the elements B11, B12, B21 and B22. Now to add these two matrices it is necessary to add each element of the matrix A to the corresponding element of the matrix B. How to do that? Well. It's very easy. First, we write A plus B equals and then write again these two matrices. For matrix A, we have A11, A12, A21 and A22 plus matrix B. B11, B12, B21 and B22. Now, to add, we need to add each element of matrix A to the corresponding element of matrix B. In case of element A11, corresponding element of matrix B is, go is going to be B11. That is, we write A11 plus B11. For, uh, for element A12, corresponding element is B12 plus B12. A21 corresponding element is B21 and for element A22 corresponding element is B22 and this is all you have to do in order to add two matrices now let's try to do this with some numbers let the first matrix consist of the elements 23 15 11 and minus 7 and the second matrix consists of the elements 8, 12, 9 and 4. Now we need to add each element of the first matrix to the corresponding element of the second matrix. That is 23 plus 8, 15 plus 12, 11 plus 9 and minus 7 plus 4. Now this, this gives us the following matrix. 23 plus 8 is 31. 
15 plus 12 is 27. 11 plus 9 is 20. And minus 7 plus 4 is minus 3. And that's all. Matrix subtraction is done in the same way as the matrix addition, but now it is necessary to subtract each element of the matrix B from its corresponding element of the matrix A. Now, how do we do that? In the same way as matrix addition. Now, let's say that we want to subtract matrix B from the matrix A. Now, we write A11 minus B11 A12 minus its corresponding element, that is B12. Now, A21 minus B21 and A22 minus B22. And that's all. Let's try to do this now with some numbers. Let the first matrix consist of the numbers 20, 37, 8 and 21. And the second matrix consists of the elements 11, 7, 8 and 10. Now, to subtract these two matrices we write 20 minus 11, 37 minus 7, 8 minus 8 and 21 minus 10. And this gives us the matrix 20 minus 11 is 9, 37 minus 7 is 30, 8 minus 8 is 0, and 21 minus 10 is 11. Matrix multiplication by scalar, that is a number, is a very simple operation. To perform this operation, it is necessary to multiply each element of the matrix by scalar. For example, let's say we have some matrix A, and we want to multiply this matrix by some scalar C. C times A equals, now we write again matrix A, C times A11, A12, a21 and A22. Now, we multiply each element of matrix A by scalar C, which gives us C times A11, C times A12, C times A21 and C times A22. And that's all you have to do. Now let's try to do this with some numbers. For example, 5 times matrix consisting of the elements 21, 10, 7, 13. Now we need to multiply each element by 5, which gives us 5 times 21, 5 times 10, 5 times 7, and 5 times 13. Now, when we calculate all this, we get the following matrix. 5 times 21 is 105. 5 times 10 is 50. 5 times 7 is 35. And 5 times 13 is 65. And that's all. And from this you can see how simple this operation is.